So I'm at a place called Wits Barbecue, and I'll give you, this is what it looks like on the outside. Uh, I'll give you some footage. But basically, uh, it's a chain of barbecue places. Uh, I've heard nothing great about it, but I haven't heard anything bad about it either. So I'm going to go in and uh, give it a try for the first time. Uh, and see what it's like. It's a, another parking lot review. Let me tell you why I do parking lot reviews. I do parking lot reviews because I'm starving. And if I'm driving around doing sauce deliveries or I'm, I'm going to meetings and I got to grab some food, I might as well pull in and do a parking lot review. So this is my second parking lot review. Uh, thanks for bearing with me. It's going to be quick and easy. I'll show you what it looks like. I'm just going to go get like a barbecue brisket sandwich. We're going to try it out. You can pretty much tell by barbecue brisket or pulled pork if a barbecue place is good or not. Okay, quick little story. So I pull up in my van, about ready to go into this Wits barbecue place, and a guy named Steve walks up, uh, wearing orange, Tennessee orange, and, and then he says, do you sell barbecue sauce? And I'm like, I'm in the van. So yeah, yeah, I do. So he bought a barbecue and a seasoning for me, and, and I said, do you like this place? Because he was coming out, I'd just eaten here. I'm like, do you like this place? Is it any good? And he's like, well, you gotta go in and give it a try and make your own opinion. It's really tough with barbecue. And I'm like, okay, cool. So I go in and I get my order and I'll show you what I ordered in a minute. And then I come out and I sit, uh, sit in my van and he pulls up and I just got out again. He says, hey, uh, hope you enjoy that barbecue. I'm like, yeah, thank you. I'm like, um, do you eat here often? And he goes, oh, I'm one of the owners. I'm like, oh, one of the owners? Okay, great. So anyway, I got to meet Steve, the owner, coming out of his own place. And, and uh, we're going to review it right now and see what happens. Okay, so... <laughs> For eight dollars, I got the pulled pork. Side of pulled pork. Well, I just say pulled pork, okay, in one of those regular containers, and then two sides, coleslaw. And one of the sides is. Can you guys guess it? Come on, guess it. What's the other side? Before I open it, ta da! Baked beans. Awesome. All right, so let me get it. So you get, you get two sides and some pulled pork, and I have some different sauces if I want to try those. But I'm not putting any sauce on it. I'm going with the pork and the bread. Let's open this up right now. Okay, so Steve has already left, and I'm standing in the back of my van eating food. It's still a parking lot, and still a review, so let's check it out. All right, so I'm just gonna try the meat first. Now, they served it up pretty quick, so it was probably already shredded, uh, but let's see, here we go. Okay, it looked dry. No way. It's way moist. Way good. I'm very surprised. I haven't heard good or bad about this place, so I just decided to pull in. That meat's really got a great flavor. Good smoke. It gushes juice. It's really, really wet. I love it. All right, so let's try the uh, try the coleslaw. Coleslaw looks like it's got. Looks like it's not a mayonnaise coleslaw. It's more of a vinegar. It's kind of drippy. Mm-hmm. Mm, real tangy. Oh, a little sweet. Um. Yeah. Pretty good. Pretty good. I'm more of a mayonnaise blood base, but I love some every so often mix it up with that good, kind of a tangy vinegar um sour coleslaw. Uh, but this has sweetness to it. It's sweet and sour. It's really good. If you like sweet and sour. This is the place. Oh, see that van right there behind me? Yeah, that, that means they do catering too. Who knew? All right, let's try their beans. Here we go. Beans are a little runny. They're kind of dripping, see that? I have to say, I like the beans that don't drip, that are kind of more clumpy and clean together, more of a brown sugar-based uh, caramelization going on, but I don't know, these might be better. Oh, wow. All right, these are really good. Um, they also have a sweetness. So you can taste the, uh, I'm guessing brown sugar. I heard it was brown sugar in it. But they taste like they're freshly cooked. I'm really impressed on how fresh everything tastes. The meat caught me by surprise, the moistness. All right. So, yeah, I'm totally bringing the family back here. It's right around the corner from where I live. Uh, Wits Barbecue. You got to check it out right here in Hendersonville. I'll see you guys on the next episode. Thanks for joining me on this parking lot review. Bye-bye.